Good morning, y'all. Um, so today is my last day of classes. It is Thursday, November 18th. I am so, I just did not vlog at all this semester. There was nothing, ex like nothing vlog worthy that was happening. But I decided that since today's my last day of classes, um, I'm gonna vlog and then tomorrow I'm moving out or heading home. Um, so I'll vlog that too. My alarm went off at 8.30 like it normally does, and then I snoozed it up until 9, and then stayed in my bed and watched TikToks until 9.20, even though I have a 9.35 class, and then was scrambling. Um, so I'm starving because I didn't eat breakfast. I'm gonna go make myself a breakfast really quickly, um, and then I'm gonna clean a little bit because the apartment's kind of dirty. texted the code to the room like the the among us room and i thought it was just one of them like you know like when you keyboard smash like it, it like looked like that and they were like why won't anyone join i was like i didn't know that was what you were asking of me sua and then so i'm like lying there and they're like lord turn your zoom camera on i was like ladies i'm literally lying in my bed in pitch black right now playing hide and seek with you guys on among us i was like there's nothing to see here Okay, so I had my breakfast and then I was watching the originals. I'm on season five, episode six now. Um, so I've been watching that since like quarantine started or qu end of quarantine. And I just like haven't watched it while I was at school. And so now I am off to go get lunch with my little. Yes. Hi, her debut. Thank you. So thank you for all of your my name is Lauren, and I just completed my last class of the semester. Yay! I'm pooped, actually, to be honest. I have all of these finals. I don't like that glare. Oh, well. But I have these finals to get through. Um, that's my little to-do board, and it's not nearly as bad as it has been in the past, but... I'm not a fan of it, regardless. I'm pooped from just staring at my computer screen this entire semester. I didn't have any in-person classes, so everything was virtual, and so my homework is also virtual, and so are my finals, and my final papers, so. How do I want to make this? So, I did my homework, I vacuumed, and cleaned. Now I'm making dinner, it's 8.22. I'm doing a stir fry because I have leftovers that I need to use and so I'm just gonna chuck it in there too. That was a bit much sriracha, but okay. As promised, I have exciting news that I haven't shared with the vlog because I haven't vlogged in so long. I never understand why I need to share news while I cook because I can't multitask as meant as seen by my inability to do this. But I've been quite busy this semester, and that's partially why I haven't really vlogged. So, first exciting news, I won my election, and I will be a member of the Board of Education in Park Ridge. I've been running a write-in campaign in my living room with Lena, my roommate, um, and I found out that I won the other day, so that's been really exciting. That's kept me a little busy. Oh, there's like one broccoli for it in here. I might as well just chuck it in there. That's gonna be a lot of broccoli though. I'm gonna do it. Oh god, that was a mistake. Hi guys, I just wanted to pop in here really, really quickly because I wanted to apologize. I clearly don't know...
how to multitask. I don't know why I keep trying to cook and tell stories. Um, however, I do want to say that I am very excited to have won my election. Um, I'm really excited for the work that I'm going to be doing in the upcoming years. I will be talking about that in an upcoming video. Um, and I do apologize that for some reason I just kind of like glossed over it. Clearly the broccoli really took up a lot of my time and attention. Um, other things I've been up to. I've been doing things for Sigma. We just crossed our biggest class, the Lambdas. Oh, I remember what I was going to tell you guys now. Never live in an apartment number that ends in 13. I will never make the mistake again. But living in an apartment numbered 13 means that our toilet has near exploded. Um, the other day I turned off, went to turn off the water and the handle just broke clean off. Like I'm not an aggressive person when I shut the water off. I just went to shut it off and then I was just holding the handle in my hand. Um, so then the faucet broke and the water was still running, which was great. And then also a couple weeks ago, like probably about a month ago, we started seeing mice in our apartment, which has been really great. Love that for us. So we noted it to like maintenance to say like, hi, we have a mouse. And so they came with the same sticky traps that they usually bring when we, Alyssa and I were like, hi, we have cockroaches. And so we got these sticky traps and they weren't really working. And instead I got stuck in one and then Maria got stuck in one. And so they weren't really catching the mice. They were just catching us. We were like, excuse me, these are doing nothing. And they found a hole behind our stove, which was great. And so now, this was at like the end of October. We're like on the third floor. We go stomping around every time we need to walk anywhere because we're like this mouse, like we're not gonna, like we're trying to scare it. And so now we feel terrible for our downstairs neighbors because we're stomping everywhere trying to scare off this mouse. They came and finally patched the stove hole about three weeks later. And luckily when they patched the stove hole, the mouse was running around in our apartment. So it didn't actually get trapped in the hole. It got trapped in our apartment. And so we, Lena decided to leave a note to the downstairs neighbors and we're like, so sorry, we constantly stomp everywhere. And so this mouse is getting like bold, it's like running around in the living room. It's not running around the edges of the room. I was not a fan. Um, we spent a lot of time standing on tables and the neighbors from downstairs came upstairs and you know, like lo and behold, it's the RA for the second floor. And she's like, we also have a mouse problem. And so we found out that there's a mouse infest, a mice infestation in Farley, which is the building that we live in. And in Gallen, which is the building we lived in last year. They came back a different day when we weren't home and um, brought us the, the traps, like the baited get your neck kinds. And that's my updates from the fall semester. I initiated the largest Sigma class. I won my writing campaign to become a public official. I live in an apartment with a mouse in mice infestation. My toilet almost exploded, but didn't. And the handle on my sink fell off. And that's on fall semester of senior year. I'm gonna go finish cooking dinner now. Good morning, you guys. So, today's Friday. I am currently in the middle of packing up my stuff. I have my laundry, my like duffel bag with clothes that I want, all the stuff on my desk I have to pack. So, I'm heading home for winter break, and it's the middle of November, the end of November, whatever. And we'll be home for two weeks, two months, who am I, until January 25th. But I have like this not so irrational fear that we might not actually come back for the semester. So I'm like trying to pack up like clothes I want to wear, like all those things. We got a buddy. Hi, Charlie. It's okay. It's kind of hot outside, not gonna lie. <laughs> Do you travel? 
This is not about you. Ma'am, ma'am, we're trying to have a moment. You're interrupting a moment. Yes. All right, it's rock and roll. I'm literally sweating. I'm getting a bubble tea from Kung Fu Tea and then I'm gonna head home. So let's hit it. Hello, I have an online order to pick up. Lauren? Yes. Perfect, thank you so much. Yeah. Tea. So I normally get milk tea, but the other day, Adriana ordered like a regular tea, no milk. It kind of slaps, not gonna lie. So, all right, let's hit the road. Hello, I'm now home. Hello, welcome home. Yeah, I'm home. And just like last time I was vlogging, I'm at another football game. So what else is new? Um, oh, I got the, so like prior to today, I was unofficially elected, but at dinner today, I got my official email that said that I'm, I won the election. So I have paperwork to fill out now and I'm like really excited um, cause it's like official official now. Um, I won with the most write-in votes. So that's very exciting. Um, I'm really thankful for like Lena helping me run a campaign. I'm very excited to be sitting on the board now. Um, but yeah, we have a football game against Ponton Lakes tonight, and so I'll be here. Last game, how do you feel? Excited. <laughs> This is all due to the outstanding dedication and talent of band director Rick Pompolivio. Tonight, in his final curtain call at Doc Lewis Stadium, with retirement set for the end of the school year, congratulations, Pops. So we're home now from the last football game. Um, the last football game after 10 years of the sums being involved in the marching band. So that's fun. Tyler. Yeah. Hello. So we're back. I'm going to eat a second dinner because I'm hungry. I just submitted my last paper. Uh, no, my first paper. Who am I? Of an era. But I'm gonna end the vlog here and I'll see you guys in the next one. But yeah, thank you for the bananas. Um, yeah, good night. <laughs>